Africa's youngest nation, South Sudan, has experienced widespread political conflicts and insecurity in recent years. The devastating impact cuts across various sectors, including education. Despite efforts by the South Sudanese government to restructure its education sector and promote a more peaceful and inclusive future, Education remains inaccessible for women and girls. In the country's Western Lakes area, a three-classroom block has been constructed at a primary school by the United Nations mission there to keep more girls in school. Take a listen. Children jubilating during the official opening of three new classrooms at the Asementi Primary School in Rumbek, South Sudan. The new block was constructed by the United Nations mission in the country with the aim of getting more girls enrolled in school in a bid to prevent them from being married off young. According to the United Nations Children's Agency, UNICEF, despite the legal age of marriage being 18, more than 50% of South Sudanese girls are wed before their 18th birthday. In discussion with parents, they say that they, know, they realize that when the girl child stays in school then at least you know the chances of being married off as very young were you know were reduced because then she'll have more time in school and keep her away from um, being married uh, early. Several years of conflict in the country left many children out of school and many others initially having to study under trees or in rundown structures in need of major repairs. The initiative is expected to bring significant change for the community when the rains would come, the children would run away and seek shelter in the old classrooms. Because part of the classroom was already damaged, we worried that it would collapse on the children. So we always asked ourselves whether we should leave the children in the rain under the tree or allow them to seek shelter in the damaged classrooms. South Sudan has the seventh highest prevalence of child marriage in the world, according to UNICEF. The agency has called for improvements in the education of children and their parents as a way of ending child marriage.